You're here because you're wondering what your love language is. You are in a situation where you are unsure why you have a hard time receiving and feeling love. And you're wondering if there's something wrong with you. And no, it's not because you are a romantic or that you can't really feel attraction to anyone, even though that could be the case. But rather, maybe you just do not know how to receive love. In fact, according to Gary Chapman, you've all probably heard of the name by now. If not, check out our YouTube video on love languages by typing it on YouTube. Later, you will learn that there are five types. Words of affirmation, quality time, physical touch, acts of service, and what's the last one? All right, receiving gifts. In fact, most people fall into one of these major categories. If you don't find yourself falling into either of these, then that's fine too because today we are going to build on the five types and share 30 more possible love languages. These are not part of Chapman's theory, but they could possibly be yours. Before we begin, try to have a notebook in front of you and a pen. Each time one of these connect with you, pause the video and add it to your list. When you finish watching from beginning to end, be sure to watch it one more time to make sure you don't miss any because you will need to show this list to your future partner so that they can show you the love that you deserve. Ready? Without further ado. Creative expression. Some people express and feel love through artistic or creative outlets like writing, painting, music, or other forms of self-expression. They may appreciate love letters, homemade gifts, or shared creative activities. Spiritual connection. For individuals with this love language, a deep spiritual or philosophical connection is essential. Sharing meaningful spiritual experiences or engaging in philosophical discussions can be a way to express and receive love. Thoughtful surprises. This love language centers around spontaneous gestures and surprises. It's not about the grandeur of the gesture, but the thought and effort put into unexpected acts of kindness or surprises. Physical presence. While physical touch is a love language, some people specifically value the presence of their loved ones. Being physically near each other, even without physical touch, is how they feel most loved. Shared experiences. This love language involves experiencing new adventures and challenges together. Whether it's traveling, exploring new hobbies, or taking on shared goals, the thrill of shared experiences deepens their connection. Emotional support. This love language emphasizes providing a strong emotional support system for your partner during challenging times. Listening, empathy, and being a shoulder to lean on are essential. Intellectual connection. Some individuals value deep intellectual conversations and mental stimulation as a way to connect and feel loved. Engaging in thoughtful discussions and sharing ideas is crucial in this love language. Acts of thoughtfulness. This is distant from acts of service and focuses on small daily acts of thoughtfulness, leaving sweet notes, making their favorite breakfast, or doing little things to brighten their day are appreciated. Nature and outdoors. For those who love nature, spending time in natural settings or going on outdoor adventures together is a way to feel loved. Hiking, camping, or simply enjoying a picnic in the park can nurture this connection. Nurturing love. This love language involves taking care of your partner in a nurturing way, like a caregiver. It can include cooking their favorite meals, providing comfort when they're unwell, or just being there to nurture their well-being. Sensory experiences. Some individuals connect through sensory experiences, like enjoying good food, wine, or aromatherapy. Preparing a special meal or creating a sensory-rich environment can speak to this love language. Digital communication. In today's digital age, some people feel loved through frequent texting, video calls, or online interactions. Staying connected through technology is essential in this love language. Reciprocal quality time. Beyond simply spending time together, this love language values shared, meaningful activities. It's about the quality and depth of time spent, whether it's a hobby, project, or learning something new together. Financial support. Providing financial security and stability can be a way of expressing love for some individuals. Ensuring their well-being through financial means is how they feel cared for. Compliments and affirmations. While words of affirmation are a love language, some people specifically value compliments and verbal affirmations of their physical appearance or character traits. 
Music and song. Some people connect deeply through music and song. Sharing their favorite songs, singing together, or creating personalized playlists can be a way to express love. Travel and exploration. For those with a passion for adventure, traveling and exploring new places together is a way to bond and feel loved. Photographic memories. This love language involves capturing and cherishing moments through photography. Creating photo albums, taking candid pictures, and reliving memories through photos are significant. Playfulness and humor. Playful banter, inside jokes, and laughter are essential for individuals with this love language. Making each other laugh and lightening the mood is how they feel loved. Acts of gardening. Gardening enthusiasts find love in tending to plants and gardens together. Planting flowers, nurturing a garden, or simply spending time in a garden can be incredibly meaningful. Shared culinary adventures. Exploring different cuisines, cooking together, or trying new restaurants are ways to express love for those who appreciate shared culinary experiences. Memory making. Creating and sharing unique memories, like hosting themed parties, going on surprise road trips, or celebrating special dates is how these individuals feel cherished. Sports and fitness. Some people connect through physical activities and sports. Engaging in sports, workouts, or outdoor fitness activities together is how they bond and feel loved. Technology assistance. For those less tech savvy, receiving help with tech related tasks, setting up gadgets, or troubleshooting tech issues is a way to feel loved. Fashion and style. Those who value their appearance and fashion sense may appreciate gestures like shopping together, styling each other, or receiving fashion related gifts. Book and literature. Sharing a love for reading and literature means exchanging books, discussing favorite authors, and spending quiet reading time together. Mindfulness and meditation. Practicing mindfulness and meditation as a couple can deepen the connection for individuals with this love language. Charity and volunteering. Some people feel loved when they engage in acts of kindness and charity together, such as volunteering or supporting a cause. Surprise getaways. Beyond simple surprises, planning spontaneous getaways or vacations can be a way to express love and adventure. Animal companionship. Individuals who adore animals may feel loved when their partners show affection to their pets or engage in animal-related activities together. 